I will now summarize the innovative technological developments that we have created in the last 10 years. In fact, constitute a new ophthalmological specialty. First I'll go over the new tools. Result of own research. Later I will detail the medical protocol. And to finish, I will define the laser technique. In 2012, we began by conducting preclinical studies of histology, clinic, and a new classification. We develop mobile applications to take high-quality photos, predict the result, and perform a 3D simulation. We also generate a genetic eye color test for orphan patients. The fundamental diagnostic equipment is the iris scanner with photography, OCT and tonography. The analyzer software provides us with the most important data prior to treatment, constituting the summary of iris. Grimaldo's summary. The maximum pressure. Trabecular blocking factor. And the clearance curve. On this slide I summarize all the progress made. Up to the left. Preliminary studies followed by clinical and classification. Mobile applications and specific software. Genetic tests for glaucoma and eye color. Eye drops. Bottom right the iris scanner. And in the corner, an example of summary. The medical protocol begins with the clinical history to detect major contraindications. Then we perform a general eye check and specific examinations, OCT gonioscopy, and honin tonography. The iris scanner is essential to obtain the iris summary. So, we show to the candidate patient the most likely prediction and a 3D simulation. Once the tests and information are completed, legal consent is signed. At the top left we see the necessary documents. Below prediction and simulation applications. Up to the right. Another summary of iris, with iris topography in 3D, and below the simulation according to the distance. Above we see an anterior segment OCT, for calculating the volume of the anterior chamber, below gonioscopy with a four-mirror lens. At the top right is the air tonometer, that we use for Honan tonography, and below the digital flare meter. Current laser iridoplasty is safe effective and predictable although it is carried out in several phases of four days in a row light eyes in one phase and retouch and the dark ones in two and final review each procedure takes less than one minute without contact or anesthesia and is painless then normal life is made without efforts vision and eye pressure are not altered although there may be minimal reactive iritis always self-limited. Color changes begin to be seen after a few weeks. The studies already published of 10 years of evolution have shown that the technique is safe, effective, and predictable. No remarkable complications. Satisfaction is progressively improving as the sessions progress. Here we see on the left cases of congenital heterochromia before and after and on the right secondary to cataract surgery, above, trauma, medium, and by topical prostaglandins, lattice. Usually, light eyes change to light blue tones, left. Those with medium to turquoise blue-green pigment, center, and the dark ones to different shades of grayish, right. This is a Horner syndrome with multinevus and positive test for apriclonidine, monocular midriasis. It changed color in a few days. In these two series we see the evolution from the beginning of two grade three cases that clear up very quickly and evolve to blue in a month. With the new laser technique we will achieve 100% safety and above all faster, 20 seconds, since a single day will suffice for both eyes of any degree of pigmentation with only one touch-up per month. The rest of the advantages. We have already achieved them with the current technique. This video shows 
The future technique. Hi, Doc. What I have to do? Open your eyes and enjoy. Perfect. That's right. Really? Awesome, Doc. Thank you very much for your kind attention.